I'll be excited to see just how much there really is already. Near the top of Vail Pass in Summit County, it's no secret there's a lot of snow. Looks like there's plenty. Plenty of snow, but just how much and what type? That's the purpose of this wilderness expedition. Yeah, ski area is like that Colorado champagne powder, but we actually prefer that it have a higher water content, that there's more moisture in the snowpack. Ooh, it sounded good. Rick Geis and Donald McCreer are part of Denver Water's snow measuring team. 41.5. 41.5. Signs mark the 11 snow courses in Summit, Park, and Grand counties. To measure the powder, crews poke holes in the snow with a hollow tube at 10 locations on the course. Depth, volume, weight, and density all help get an accurate picture of how much water is in the snow. At Denver Water, we love seeing all the snow, but what we really care about is the water content because that's what's going to end up in the reservoirs this spring. What do you think? So far, so good? In Summit County, the mountains picked up more than 13 feet of snow in December and January. Melted down, the snow would turn into more than 10 inches of water. Water that ends up in rivers and streams that flow into Dillon Reservoir. Snowpack's looking really good right now, but we've got a long way to go, and you never know what might happen this spring. It's important that we get out here and get our hands on just exactly what's going on out here in the outdoors because it's so important to our water supply.